Ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to talk about something that seems to be straight out of a sitcom. That's right, it's politics. <laughs> so there's this article about Keir Starmer's latest U-turn on tuition fees, and oh boy, do we have some mixed messages. I don't know if it's just me, but it seems like these politicians have a very hard time making up their minds. Ugh. One minute they're cutting higher education funding, the next they're yelling, what about vocational education? It's like they're trying to assemble IKEA furniture without the instruction. Instead of redistributing education spending, it looks like the Tories just wanted to reduce government spending altogether. It's as if Robin Hood took from the rich but kept it all for himself. <laughs> so now, Labor's gotta find some way of coming up with the cast to fund their proposed spending increases. You know what their big solution is? Efficiency improvements. We're gonna make some changes, we're gonna find the funds, and we're gonna do it by... Magic! Or at least that's what it sounds like. They also seem to think the middle classes can afford these high fees. <clears throat> Newsflash! Years of slow growth and public sector austerity have hit the middle class too. It's like expecting a runner to break a world record after spending years in the straitjacket. Things are getting so out of hand with this student fees loan scheme that even the economist Tynan Minsky would call it Ponzi financing. <laughs> it's like buying a used car that won't start hoping it'll magically transform into a Ferrari. When it comes to the flawed approach on education spending, I just have to sigh and wonder who comes up with these plans. Huh. Maybe they should stop treating education like a bizarre either-or game and instead focus on benefiting all students regardless of their background. I don't know about you, but it seems like British politics needs a serious U-turn itself. <laughs> or better yet, just the giant reset button. Things have gotten so wacky, I can't even tell if I'm watching the news or a Monty Python sketch anymore. This podcast is brought to you by AI Pictures.